<laughs> oh, Beast Boy and Kansas Rebel Man. Y'all are some girls, man. Like, for real. And we finna get into it, y'all. But first, y'all know how we do. <laughs> Intro! Yo, it's me, your boy, JJV. What is good, Great White Gang? What is good, Creek Squad fam? And what is good, Saints Squad fam? It's your boy, Jason JV, saying welcome to another review, Vidya. Now, if you guys caught my music's reaction, then y'all know. Y'all know what this is all about right here. You see it on your screen, right? This is the uh, live from BS. BX Beast Boy, by the way, uh, Beast Boy from Teen Titans called. He wants his name back, bro. Anyway, um, this is the live from BX Beast Boy, along with Kansas Rebel Man um, as his co-host. And what we're about to get into is the clip from his live that Beast Boy uh, posted. And uh, unfortunately, it's like almost fifty minutes long. But we ain't, we ain't gonna get into like the whole reaction aspect of it. As a matter of fact, let's kind of fast forward this a little bit because I want to get to the part where these two girls, right? These two little gossip bitches here. I don't care if we pass the 30 minute mark, man. I'll sacrifice, you know, the monetization for this because I'm sick and tired of this shit, dude. Um, these guys, excuse me, these girls were reacting to Mises' song and... They heard a line in the song, which we will get into, where they misheard the line. Now, to be fair, I couldn't make out the line myself. Go back and watch my reaction. I was having trouble with it. But thanks to the homie Alpha Tyler, shout out to the brother Alpha Tyler, who, who also happens to be Mises' DJ, by the way, and who was with Mises at the time when Mises wrote this song, which was uh, country rap Kendrick told me what smartened me up on the line. Now, I'll tell you what the line actually is when we get to it. And uh, we're going to get into some other shit, too. But uh, let's go ahead and jump right into this video clip, shall we? But I like in the hit, hit. And then rap that they're never gonna back up Could it back up when they see the strap tuck Thought you tryna act up Don't get it fucked up Boy, I still knuckle up Double up, two-piece Catch him with an uppercut Leave him in a puddle of blood Like a couple slugs Hit him in the chest on the best You the fucking run the rug hey, I ain't mad, I love you You ain't running that Acting like the devil I'm gonna send your ass on the head Hey, yeah, how did it I'm not mad at the flow Right I'm not mad at the flow I'm, I'm waiting for the part That people keep saying He's dissing Ryan, though that's what I'm saying, because right, right now, he, he, all he says is acting, I mean, acting like a devil, like he's going to punch him up, beat his ass, he, then he's going to, homie, he's going to run, and then, you know, he's acting like a devil. That's what he just said. And, and he can't be talking about Ryan with that. Right now, bro, Ryan's, what? what? <laughs> if he, he is. can't be talking about Ryan with that. By the way, this song is not about church, okay? It's... And it's definitely not a diss towards church. All right. Anyway. What? That'd be crazy. That is probably more accurate. Yeah, maybe. He's probably talking about Tom. Maybe. I don't want no problem. Man, none of y'all want no small. Tell Ryan to holler. Boy, could the boy been down? Oh, he says that. So this is the line right here, right? Now listen to what they think they heard. Tell Ryan to holler. Yeah, I mean, that, he said his name. Shit. Uh, Mises now, wants is to, that Mises what... wants to smoke, like you said, bro. So because Mises mentioned Ryan by name, he must want to smoke. Are you sure about that, bro? Are you sure? Yes, Bend down, I don't smoke. Tell Ryan to holler. So they're going to tell you what they think they heard, right? But then look at this. this you know, Beast Boy, this is where you messed up. Because even though the caption is wrong, it still got a lot closer than y'all did, which is very sad. <laughs> so tell Ryan to holler. The boy been. What? Well, 
before I reveal what the real line is, again, we're going to hear what they think they heard. Super direct. He didn't say up church, though. That's because he did that on purpose. So people could speculate and like question it. Mm-hmm. And, and so and so it could be getting talked about. <laughs> she just working to some degree. I mean, I mean, it's got you little girls talking about it. Yeah, bro. And I mean, bro. <laughs> 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 I ain't trying to shit on nobody, bro. But I'm just no. saying, bro. Okay, bro. <laughs> if this was a shot at Ryan, this was weak sauce, bro. I ain't going front. Ain't trying to shit on nobody, but yeah, here they are shitting on somebody. Niggas, hmm. <laughs> yo, Rebel was sitting here like, all right, uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, all right, all right, uh. Come on, Shay, put your glasses put back. Your glasses on. back on, Shay. <laughs> <laughs> I've been waiting to tell somebody that. I can't wait. Man, they, they, they sound like a bunch of cackling hens, don't they? A couple of cack- cackling hens. Taking forever to tell what they think they heard. I can't yeah. wait, man. Let me see, Buckle. What the stream link? Uh, what? What the stream link, dog? Oh, uh, I don't, uh, <laughs> look, I don't uh, we ain't, are we taking any guests right now? No. Nah. No. And you know who that was that was asking for the stream link? The homie Alpha Tyler. He wanted to come up on panel to clear up, you know, the meaning behind the song. And you see how these two little bitches didn't re- you know, refuse to let, let the homie up? And it's because at the time, they didn't know that Tyler was not only Mises' DJ, but also Mises' best friend. See what happened after, the day after, Mises went live, broke down the song, and then BX Bitch Boy right here tried to hop up on Mises' live and was demanding the link. Didn't ask for it, he was demanding the link, saying, give me the link, give me the link. Uh Uh-uh, my guy. See, you had your chance. You had your chance to talk to Alpha Tyler. And you didn't let him up on your panel. So why should he let you up on Mises' panel? Hmm? Hmm? See, would it have made a difference if you knew beforehand? I mean, it shouldn't have mattered. I mean, if the dude says he knows the meaning behind the song, why not let him up and hear him out? Instead of assuming he was a troll, right? And then not and then banning not just one account, you ban his second account. And the guy was simply just asking to have a conversation with y'all. But no, see, you guys want to push this narrative and try to fabricate a beef out of a, a mistake that you made. Uh, he's from Illinois. He, he, he's from, he's from, he's best friends with Adam, bro. Yeah, yeah. He, he. Oh, look at that. Oh, he's best friends with Adam. And then you see Beast Boy's reaction. He's like, well, that explains it. So it must be a diss. As soon as you said, I already knew. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You best friends with, you. Best friend with Adam, bro. This is almost, it's exactly what I said. Adam is crossing over to this whole little trying to do country bullshit, trash ass album. I tried to listen to it today. Garbage. Garbage. Hot garbage. And then this guy, I guess he's trying to be Adam, but was Adam. Con- <laughs> Yo, uh, just, it's a no for me, dog. I don't think he's not. He's not. No. Jen, so uh, Jen said, "What's the topic? The topic is uh, 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 is Mises uh, dissing Ryan um, because I he think says that he is. He, he literally says his name. He, he lit- so apparently, when you say somebody's name, that means you're 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 dissing them. Hmm. Okay." No, that's funny. I said church's name many a time. So th- does that mean I've dissed church many a times? Hmm. 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 I just, I mean, I, I said my, my man uh, Alpha Tyler's name. Does, does that mean I just dissed him? Hmm. Is that how this works now? Are you guys trying to change the rules when it comes to rap and hip hop? Are we not? Are we not allowed to shout out people who are killing it in the game? Show love, show respect. Is that how that works? I'm just asking questions. Literally says his name. It does Barclay. sound like he said, tell Ryan's, tell Ryan Hollow. What does he say after that? He says, barking dog? 
That's what it sounds. Bark of the bark boy of the, of the barking dog. So they think Mises said barking dog. Something about a barking dog. What? Again, it's sad that a caption, the closed caption, got closer than they did. I'm just saying. So basically what he's saying right there is that he's all bark, no bite. That's what it sounds. Let me hear it one more time. Y'all don't want no problem. Man, none of y'all want no smoke. Tell Ryan to holler. Bark of the barking dog. Bark of the barking dog. That's what it sounds like. Bark of the barking dog. Yeah, bro. You all bark. No, no. Oh, my God. Kansas Rev, man, you so off on that end pronunciation because he's clearly saying, oh, and you're and you're saying, ah. Oh. And how drunk were you that night? <laughs> I'm just saying. Oh, bite. That's what it sounds like. OK, y'all. So you want to know what Mises really said? Tell Ryan to holler, boy, because the boy been dope. Tell Ryan to holler, boy, because the boy been dope, meaning Ryan has always been dope. So Mises was showing love, showing respect to Ryan Upchurch. And these clowns, these girls, these little gossip girls right here, misheard a line and they're trying to spin it to fabricate beef between church and Mises why I don't know and see here's why Kansas Rebel Man and Beast Boy come off so fake to me have y'all been watching church's vlogs lately church has Three important things going on right now that require his attention more. He's gearing up to drop Creaker 3. He just dropped a vlog not long ago, you know, showing, showing little previews of a song that's going to be on the Creaker 3 album, which is long overdue, by the way. And I can't wait. The man is also trying to rebuild, rebuild his house. He was painting one of the rooms. He was up early in the morning, I believe around 3 a.m. He was painting one of the rooms. And he said something about, I guess, there was some water damage in one of the other rooms. The, the, that the floor, I guess, fell in or whatever. And it caused a lot of damage. So, you know, the man is trying to fix his house because, more importantly, he's trying to prepare for the new addition in his family. He's preparing for the arrival of his baby girl. So he's got these three, these three things going on. And you two fuck boys want to bring this undue stress onto him and onto his wife, Beth, who is with child right now. Why? For who? For what? For clicks? For views? For the numbers? Beast Boy, you dropped a shit ton of Tom McDonald slam videos, and don't get me wrong. I was a big fan of those. Because uh, if you follow me long enough, people know I've had my issues with Tom. I've had my issues with his hog riders, his hog bots. So, I enjoyed those videos. But you got overly obsessive with those. You've also dropped some um, a shit ton of videos on Adam Calhoun, right? And you said some some real suspect shit, saying like, "Oh, how Adam supposedly invited you to his warehouse," and then you said some 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 slick shit like, "Oh, like maybe you, you should go so that way you, you know you can get Adam to punch you in the face so you can take him to court, sue him, and then take that lawsuit money and use it to build your own studio." If that don't scream clout chase, I don't know what does. But um, and then you have the nerve to call other people clout chasers and shit, dog. I see how you move, dog. You move a little funny. Let's get back to the subject matter at hand here. You want to call yourselves Creakers, right? You want to act like you're part of Creek Squad. Well, here's what Creek Squad don't do. Creek Squad don't lie. They don't make up 
drama. They don't stir up, you know, bullshit. You know what I mean? And they take it to church. That's not what they do. And obviously you don't listen to church's interviews very well. Because you know what church, church doesn't like? He doesn't like dick writers. He doesn't like liars. As a matter of fact, when it comes to lying, you know what church said about lying? When you tell one lie, you got to tell another lie on top of that to support that that first lie. Then you got to tell another lie on top of the other one. Then you got to keep telling more lies to support your previous lies and get to where you get to the point where you forget what your original lie was even about. If you tell the truth, you never have to take an L. Church said that. Right now, you guys are racking up so many L's. It's unbelievable. And you're still, to this day, Still pushing that narrative. All because you misheard a line. You made a mistake. And yet you can't be mad enough to man enough to admit that you made a mistake. You can't be mad enough to admit that you misheard a line. And that you misunderstood what Misa said. Tell Ryan to holla, boy, because the boy been dope. What Misa was saying there was that, yo... Have Ryan holler at me, or I can holler at him. You know what I mean? So we can get together, chill, shoot the shit, maybe work on some shit. That's what that was all about. It was not a diss track towards Ryan up church at all. Shame on y'all, and shame on anyone who supports this bullshit narrative. You're bringing undue stress to the man, while again, he's in the middle of rebuilding his house, gearing up to drop Creaker 3, and again, most importantly, preparing preparing to have his baby girl y'all are sad y'all are weak y'all are pathetic in my opinion i don't care what anyone says but in my opinion at least y'all ain't real creakers y'all ain't y'all ain't y'all don't deserve to be creek squad but again that's just my opinion so anyways y'all till these fools these little shit stirrers get their heads out of their collective asses i ain't rocking with them no more i'm not gonna tell anyone else what to do y'all want to support kansas rebel man y'all want to support beast boy now knowing what they're up to and what they're trying to do, that's on you. All I know is I ain't rocking with these fools anymore, man. Because, like I said, I ain't about that drama. You know what I mean? I ain't with the bullshit. You know what I mean? I, 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 I just don't get it. Why, why create division between Saint Squad and Creek Squad? When, really, this is a time when we all should be united together. We should all be banding together, united. But no, y'all want to stir the shit, create division. I, I I don't get it. No, actually, no, I take that back. I do get it. I see wh why you're doing this shit. Again, it's for the clicks. It's for the views. It's for the numbers. Because, Beast Boy, I know you rap, and your music ain't doing that great. And that's why you're doing this shit. And you know your music is not the best because <laughs> you need money to build a real studio. And you were trying to come up with a sneaky suspect way to get the money to build your studio hmm, by trying to get adam to punch you in the face so you can take him to court sue him you're a whole bitch you're bitch made see beast boy let me tell you tell you tell you a little, little, little something all right i grew up in the hood all right and trust me in the hood we had fools like you who had nothing better to do nothing worthwhile going on with their lives so what do they do they go and start some fucking he said she said bullshit which is what you and your girlfriend right there are doing and you know what happens to people like that? And I'm not making no threats. I'm just saying. Just take this as, as a lesson. People like that, they get their asses whooped. And usually after they get their asses whooped, they learn not to do shit like that again. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Again, that's not a threat. That's I'm, that's just how it is, man. It's, you, don't, you don't do shit like that, dude. You don't bring undue stress on the people who, again, who got a lot going on in, in their life right now. New album dropping, house being rebuilt, them expecting their firstborn child. Do better. That's all I got to say. Anyways, y'all, that's pretty much all I got to say about these two fools, man. Uh, Beast Boy does have another video I do want to review and call him out on. Because, uh, again, I don't like the way this, this dude moves. I don't like the way he speaks. This dude's on some suspect shit. And we'll get into that in a, we'll get into that more in the next video. But until then, 
Y'all know the deal. Like, comment, share, and of course, subscribe, especially if you're digging the vibes, especially if you're new and you're digging the vibes, that is. And uh, yeah. Yeah. Till the next one. Y'all have a blessed one. Peace. Jason JV on YouTube. Uh, what's up with you, Jason JV? What up, Jason? JV. I'm just sending love, peace, and blessings to you. Jason, you are my homeboy, my guy. Don't call me guy, pal. Don't call me buddy, pal. Much love to you, JV. Chris Calico. Cali, baby. Oh. What's up, JV? My name's Jimmy Patrick. I'm one half of the next video. I'm going to say what's up, Jimmy. Take your motherfucking head up. Uh, uh, I don't know why you're sad. If you're sad, you're sad. If you're sad, you're sad. If you're sad, you're happy. I'm going to be too happy. I'm going to be expecting shit. It's like it occurs all the time. So you're ready to be on the swerve. So subscribe. Tap the little bell. Turn on the notifications. And if you're not down with that, we got three words for you. Eat it. Yeah.